Introduction The principles of chemistry have been used for the benefit of mankind. We shall learn the application of chemistry in three areas, namely medicines, food materials and cleansing agents. The table shown above illustrates the importance of chemistry in our daily life. Drugs and their classification. Drugs are chemicals of low molecular masses. These interact with macromolecular targets and produce a biological response. When the biological response is therapeutic and useful, these chemicals are called medicines and are used in diagnosis, prevention and treatment of diseases. Drugs may be classified mainly on criteria as shown above. Enzymes as drug targets. In their catalytic activity, enzymes perform two major functions as shown above. Drug-enzyme interaction. Drugs inhibit any of the above mentioned activities of enzymes. These can block the binding site of the enzyme and prevent the binding of substrate or can inhibit the catalytic activity of the enzyme. Such drugs are called enzyme inhibitors. Drugs compete with the natural substrate for their attachment on the active sites enzymes. Such drugs are called competitive inhibitors. Some drugs do not bind to the enzyme's active site. These bind to a different site of enzyme which is called allosteric site. This binding of inhibitor at allosteric site changes the shape of the active site in such a way that substrate cannot recognize it. If the bond formed between an enzyme and an inhibitor is a strong covalent bond and cannot be broken easily, then the enzyme is blocked permanently. The body then degrades the enzyme inhibitor complex and synthesizes the new enzyme. Receptors as drug targets. Receptors are proteins that are crucial to body's communication process. Majority of these are embedded in cell membranes. Receptor proteins are embedded in the cell membrane in such a way that their small part possessing active site projects out of the surface of the membrane and opens on the outside region of the cell membrane. In the body, message between two neurons and that between neurons to muscles is communicated through certain chemicals. These chemicals, known as chemical messengers, are received at the binding sites of receptor proteins. To accommodate a messenger, shape of the receptor site changes. This brings about the transfer of message into the cell. Thus, chemical messenger 